Kamala Harris had a chance to reach millions of Americans directly but chose to avoid Joe Rogan's podcast, citing scheduling conflicts and requesting only an hour-long chat far from the three-hour deep dive Rogan afforded Donald Trump. Rogan, a self-professed open book, gave Harris' team every option, offering to interview her at any hour and any day. Yet Harris' team balked, reportedly pushing for travel accommodations and tighter control over the interview setup, raising questions about her confidence in a freewheeling conversation. With polls showing a tight race in swing states, Rogan's massive platform could offer Harris the very exposure she needs, particularly among male voters who skew Trump. Meanwhile, Trump's recent Rogan episode has racked up 17 million YouTube views, discussing everything from UFOs to government transparency. Rogan's audience, 81% male and mostly under 35, represents the very voters Harris needs to win over, especially as her recent Fox interview displayed her vulnerabilities. So, why not accept the open invitation? With her team wary of a long-form format, voters are left wondering what does she have to hide? In the final days before the election, this decision could be the make-or-break moment. Harris' reluctance speaks volumes about the current political landscape, and millions of Rogan listeners are waiting for answers.